Free kick and a chance here for Kelly. He scored! Yeah. It's going to be extra time winner. Connor Jennings, James Norwood. Yes! James Norwood has scored it. De Vries with the cross. The header. It's in. It's Connor Jennings. Good afternoon and welcome back to a trip to the moon. I am genuinely excited this season. I really want to keep playing it. So I've made about what three four episodes today so and i'll show you why in a second but take a look at the schedule since you were last with me which was the 4-1 win over shorker we dispatched everton 3-1 this was a bit of a struggle the burnley game 1-0 and then we beat west brom 6-0 <laughs> we went away to keep you on 1-2-0 this game could have been i don't know 40-0 but we always scored twice a bit of an odd one i played everton if you see here at goodison park but i'm using their new ground bramley dock I'm not sure. Now I did definitely check the new ground is going to be caught is going to be on the dock, and Liverpool aren't playing there, so there's a brand new ground sitting there that nobody's using. That now I am, so I don't know why there must be a glitch in the game that Everton haven't moved grounds, but the ground has been built, so it, it's an odd one. So look at the table. I mean, and look at it. it. It is unreal. We have a goal difference of 17 after five games. We have absolutely smashed everyone. 2-0, 6-0, 1-0, 3-1, 6-0. Other than the 1-0, all been very comfortable. Okay, you might say we haven't played anyone yet. We haven't. Um, and look at the top goal scorer list. Becker isn't top yet, which is strange. But look at all the other players. Little, Gomez, Scotter, Becker. We're getting goals from everywhere. So that's why he's not top. Becker, he's still getting 8.1. Robbie Chu, second most assists. He's coming and done really well. I didn't manage to sell any players. So I can't give Brennan his new contract. Look at our Champions League group. It is a buy. We've got Marseille, Copenhagen again, and into Milan. The media said it is basically a buy into the next round. So that's what we're going to see today. We're going to see Marseille, and we're going to see Leeds. So the team we're going to go with for the Marseille game is this. And this is why I'm excited. Look at this. Four and a half star, four and a half star, five star, five star, four and a half star, five star, four and a half. It is just an exciting team. I don't need Dewhurst on the bench, though. Um... Saru can come on the bench there. And Sandy did sign his contract. He is now a Trammy player for good. Four and a half star. Just unbelievable. So we got a, just a great team. So we'll get into the game. I'm pretty sure you won't recognise any of Marseille's team, to be honest. But we'll have a look now. Distracted there momentarily by a phone call. Marseille have... Now this boy, Simone... He's been suggested now. He was suggested to me a couple of seasons ago as a fire as an absolute buy, whatever the price, but he doesn't seem to have come on that well. Is that one was three, four years ago, maybe. So he was 22, 23. Other than that, Panzo's there. Panzo must be getting on a bit now. 28 history. He is English, isn't he? He is. So he was originally at Chelsea, went to Monaco, he's been all over the place. Some money spent on him, like 74 million, but again, nothing to fear from. Monaco here, it's like Marseille. I mean, yesterday, I went, well, the other day, I went through a whole episode of calling Sport and Lisbon, uh, Benfica, <laughs> done it again, Benfica, Sport and Lisbon. Did I say that aggressively? I did, didn't I? That's because I'm talking. Uh, I had to put a little caption on when I was editing and going, listen, I know it's Benfica. Definitely not Sport and Lisbon. I was going to say yesterday, but that is about four episodes ago <laughs> where we are now. It's a long throw into the box. Rainer picks it up. Schaefer, I didn't even show you. Did I show you the team? I didn't even show you the team. We'll get back to it in a second and I'll talk you through it. Taylor, down the wing. Come on, just take it off him. We do. Rayner picks it up. Rayner is playing very well at the moment as well. <laughs> I say that as he does that. So team-wise, we've gone with Becca, Little, Rayner, Scotter, Chu, Fofana, Serrano, Corrado, Chiatti, Schaefer and Renan. Off the top of my head. If it's not Chiatti, I'm sorry. It could be Nicolou. There he is, Di Simone. That's a great tackle. It is Chiatti because that's a great tackle from him. They're still coming at us though. There's a few English player names. They've got a Taylor, they've got a Jones there, they've got Panzo. Very English centric Marseille team. I wish I had that many English players in my team. Right, Serrano. All the way back to Renan. Grumpy Renan to Serrano to Chiatti to Serrano. Back to Renan again. Chiatti. 
Fafana. Look at this. Just it's just uh, it's ticky tacker, isn't it? Really, but that's not how we play. We play Gengen. Little out wide. Can he get a good ball into the box? He can to Reina, and there it is. One nil Tramia at Bramley Dock, which <laughs> makes no sense at all. Bramley Moor Dock. I, I'm I'm never gonna get over this glitch. We're using Everton's ground, and they're not allowed to. <laughs> well, this should be our record. Um, we got our record attendance last game. This should be our record gate receipts, is the word I'm looking for. Right, back again. Right, I, I would have used wingers today. Actually, in fact, I probably should have used wingers at home here. I've been using wingers at home against the weaker teams and then playing this diamond away because we seem to be more comfortable. Scotter into the box, and there we go. 2 0 Tramia. We're just a very, very good team. And that's why I'm excited to play. So I've wanted to play a big chunk of games. And every time I get I get some games, I think, oh, I'm going to make an episode here. I did say I would. Somebody did ask me what other plans are for ending this. And it's either a win a quadruple of every trophy can win. Or we bypass Liverpool's six Champions Leagues. Um, either or. FM21 isn't out for a while. I do have an absolute ball or a plan for that. Uh, I'm hoping to catch the wave where I get it, get there as it comes out. But I, I do have a great idea. I don't want to give too, too much away because I don't want someone to nick it. But it, I, I, I think it's a good idea. I've run it past a few people and they do too. Schaefer. To Chiati. To Schaefer. To Chiati again. Ball to Becca. Can Becca get a decent ball into the box? He can. It's not quite there from Little. We do a bit of harrying. We win it back again. Scotter. Chew. Fafana. Scotter again. Becker's got it back. Can he square it? He can. And it's 3 0, Tratmia. We're just. Wow. We just blow teams away. Just not no hope at all. And on transfers. Now, I did have Sandro and um, Thomas agree deals to go. And they rejected the contract again. I mean, Sandro rejected yet another contract, this time with Lille. He'd rejected Atletico Madrid, Lille, Bournemouth, and another couple of Premier Leagues, Everton. But. He refuses to go. He's getting the same wage. In fact, I was paying some of his wages. This is really odd. We have absolutely minced Marseille here, but they've had more of the ball. Maybe it's the keeper picking out the net that <laughs> does this. Um, you know what? I, I am going to say, keep it up, lads. Just get out. I, I'd like a few more goals, please. Corrado. For, it's Floria, I think that was. Corrado, Fafana, Scotter, Chu. I thought he was going to score a cracking own goal then. They got a blue and goal just called David. All right, Dave. It's balled out. Can we take it back off them again? Jones out wide. Into Borgia. Panzo's got it there. He gets it dispossessed. And we're good at that Harry and now. We're really... Oh, he should have scored. He should have scored. You expect more from Becker. But we are doing the Harry and very well at the moment. I am going to take Becker off. And bring on Sarul just to give him a bit more time. Right, Becca, where are you? Saru, you can come on as a pressing forward. Have a bit of a break. And Scotter needs a bit of a rest. So we bring on Gomez as a no-brainer. We're already 3-0 up. There's no point um, making everyone knackered. Who else have we got on the bench? We've got Thomas on the bench. You can come on Corrado in a minute. Oh, no, Chew's injured. That is not. That is the world's worst injury. Richter's going to come on for Chew. I should have had Miles on the bench. Look, world-class midfielder, world-class midfielder. Lopez, over the bar. Again, we should still be scoring more goals. I'm trying to get Saru a bit more match fit. Uh, I mean, he could do with it. He's, it's, I thought he was going to score as soon as he came on there. Again, itchy nose, this hay fever's killing me. Right, Isaac into the box, and they pull a goal back. It's Jones. Curtis Jones, I wonder where he's from. Again, he is English. He's come from Liverpool. 33 million. Oh, I think I, I think I do know Curtis Jones. It's a good run from Isaac, and it's a good ball to the back post, but we should be doing better. I mean, look at all these players in the middle here. Nobody mark at the back post. 3-1. It takes the gloss off it a bit. We, we come out the blocks like on fire, didn't we? Right, ball into the box from Lopez. Don't concede another one. 
We get it away. Richter picks it up. Can he pick out a man? It doesn't matter. He's going on his own. Look at him. He's, he's round everybody. He's gone on. He's hit the post. Fair play to him. That was some run. I'd like to have seen him score that. There we go. 3-1 win. Happy enough. Appreciate the efforts. First win in the Champions League this season. And we'll move on to the Leeds game. Let me see first, inbox-wise, if this is our record. I need to praise a little there, but... Did we break our... It's record attendance broken, but didn't break the ink gate receipts. Oh, there it is. New gate receipts, 2.2 million for that. Last was 1.2 million to Copenhagen. So, there we go. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to click on to the Leeds game, and I'll see you in a second. Welcome back for the Leeds game then. Some changes forced, some unforced. We're going to go, we're just going to go for Leeds. We've got gone to our wingers here. Cesar and Sandy are going to get a game. We've got Saru who's going to get a game as well. Just get, build a bit of match fitness. Um, we've lost Corrado for five weeks, which is which is great. Robbie Chu, I'm going to give him, you know what? I was going to give him a break, but I'm a little concerned. I don't want to give him a break now. So I'm going to bring him back onto the bench. The bench? Anyway, and, and this is how we line up. Again, we've, we've rested a lot of our midfield, but we've got Gilson, Cesar, Saru, Becker, Sandy, Richter, Miles, Thomas, Nicolou, Chiati, Schaefer, and Renan. Thomas desperately needs some match fitness because he is going to have to play there while Corrado's out for a while. Look at their team. Pinamonte is always a thorn on our side. Bogus is there, and Nico Williams. The rest are just new guns. So we should be, again, we should be winning this comfortably. Passively like say... A team such as ours should be winning this. Everyone was motivated by that, apart from Sandy. Of course, Sandy is a pain in the backside. But he may, he may after his big contract, he may put a, some sort of performance in here. But Sandy, ball into the box, comes back out. Can we? Oh, it's just over the bar. And look, I'm expecting a performance from Richter as well. Uh, I... Again, he's a world-class midfielder. He never... I like him. And he comes in and does a job, but he never... He never shy. He's not like Chew or... You know, comes in and just is outstanding. He just does... He goes about his business, I suppose, quite well. I'm talking rubbish, aren't I? But this is a very boring game. We'll go very attacking early. We should be comfortably winning this game. And we're going to get half-time with that one chance. That's it. Aggressive. I'm disappointed. I'm not happy. I'm not. I don't care if you look stressed, Schaefer. Get out there and score me some goals. So this might be from the kickoff. We score a goal here. Thomas. Cesar. Back to Thomas. At wide to Nicolou. Miles. It's a poor ball in. Again, you know what? I might bring Chew on for Miles here. That was that wasn't good. Pinamonte drives forward and. Thankfully, he is useless. I know he's been a bit of a thorn on our sides, but he isn't great. Look at this. Wingers are playing awfully. Saru's bad. Everyone's playing badly. Sandy picks up the ball. He gets it to Becker. Becker is no... He's just so fast, isn't he? He's got it back again. Ball back into the box. We've missed an absolute sitter there. I'm making three substitutions here. Um, Cesar can come off for Almada Saru can come off for Eddie Little I'm going to have to bring I'm going to bring Chu on Chu is going to come on in his normal Mazzola role and save us please if, if somebody gets injured now I'm going to be annoyed but Schaefer picks it up this is supposed to be Chu's break Renan Nicolou Renan again we just seem to lack creativity Chiati Schaefer. To Sandy. Sandy, over to Chew. Chew out wide to Schaefer. Schaefer to Sandy. He's gone again. Yeah, there it is. Schaefer. Back to Richter. Richter into the box, and he's offside. Knew it. Knew it was coming. If you see when you score, it doesn't immediately come up here with the name of the scorer and who's, who's assisted. You know it's offside. And there's two of them off there. It's poor, isn't it? It's a rubbish game. What is going on? Chew with the corner. No one can get on the end of it. Richter. Back to Schaefer. Back to Chew. Chew to Almada. And there we go. 1-0 Tramia. Thank God for that. Second goal of the season. Another assist by Chew. 
who's already made a difference since he's come on. We'll drop down to just attacking. I mean, he doesn't do much here, too. He just knocks it forward, but this is a good finish. Outside of the right foot, into the bottom corner. Almada, he scored two goals already this season. He's been a bit, he's been a bit poor player since Rain has come in, but he's doing well. You know, he's on big wages, though. Maybe we should look to sell him next. But this is... I brought you the most boring game in the world here, haven't I? I should have picked the next game against Man City at home. Sandy just hasn't played well at all. Although he's picked up a little bit. Becker's not had a great game. And it's going to be a 1-0 win, isn't it? And there we have it. A boring 1-0 win over Leeds. That's on 19 straight wins. That is unreal. Uh, I'm disappointed I am. Aggressive. Yeah, there we go. You'll be back in training tomorrow. There's no break. Right. Where's that leave us? I should have shown you the league there. Renan leaks all my... Every time I'm angry, he just leaks it. So let's have a look at what's left of the league. We are top of the league, of course. Two points clear of Man City. Five wins in a row. Goal difference is 18. Goal, we've only conceded one goal this season. That's my rubbish defence. Yeah. Okay, alright, we haven't played anyone good. We, we play Man City next to home, so we'll see how we get on then. When are we coming back? That's what you want to know. When do we come back? I'm going to play a whole rake of games here, and maybe... Hmm. I'm going to come back for this Inter Milan game. Inter Milan here, and full them away. Oh, do I? Yeah, we'll come back for this Inter Milan game. So we'll play Inter Milan away, we'll play full them away. And, uh, yeah. That'll do. That'll do. I want to get a whole bunch of games out the way here. By this time, we should have. Let me see. One, two. We, we may clinch at qualification here, so we'll come back for that. But listen, if you're enjoying this, please like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I'll see you all again tomorrow. Okay.